reviewing Experience Biology Elementary from Journey Homeschool Academy. Now I am absolutely in love with this curriculum. I cannot express that enough. I love every single component to it and I'm going to walk you through every component and tell you all about it. Now, the great thing with this Journey Homeschool Academy program is that once you have purchased it, the elementary biology program, you get lifetime access to it. So if you wanna use it with younger kids, if you wanna keep reusing it, you wanna go back to the videos, you can do all of that because you have lifetime access to it. I just love that. I have been using this program with my four-year-old, my eight-year-old, and my 10-year-old. Now my four-year-old is technically a little young, but she's actually been really kind of keeping up with her sisters. There is a couple different components to the program that I wanna tell you about. So the first one is the online videos. So the whole curriculum is online. And when you log into your account on Journey Homeschool Academy, you will see all the lessons. So the creators of the curriculum have made a video for every lesson teaching the material to your child. The videos are super engaging and really well done. So I have my girls just sit around the table and they watch the video together. Then you have some downloadable products and I will show you this in a minute. So in addition to the video lesson, there's a couple other components that you can download. And so every lesson has some book recommendations. So you can check these out from your library or get them wherever you'd like, or you don't have to get them at all. You can just watch the videos and do the other things that are included. But I, I personally love how there is book recommendations because I love to tie in literature and I don't always wanna have to go search for a book that matches the topic that has also been vetted. So this is a Christian curriculum. And so what I noticed is in the book recommendations, if it mentioned anything questionable, they would put a note for you right there telling you, you know, this book mentions this on page whatever. And so I actually really appreciated that, that they gave me the heads up, but they still thought that the book was worthwhile to use, but then I could choose to skip that part or not. After the book recommendation, there's always an activity. So this is some sort of hands-on activity. We made edible DNA, which so far was the girl's favorite because who doesn't love candy DNA? But it might be a cut and paste activity, a variety of different activities to do throughout the curriculum. There is also a little quiz. There is a memory component. So every lesson also has a short, like three minute memory video. And this video covers the memory work for that week. In addition, they're also me memorizing a chapter from Genesis over the course of the entire year. But each week there is some sort of scientific facts and information that they are going to be memorizing. So if you're a classical homeschooler, this also fits really well with that, but it's good for any homeschooler. You can totally skip that part if you wanted, but it's actually one of my girls' favorite part. They love memorizing information. Most kids actually do. And there's also copywork pages in both cursive and print. So not only are they practicing their handwriting, so getting a little sneaky handwriting practice in, but they're also learning those scientific facts and information through the copywork. So I'm going to take you through some of the downloadable products and I'm also going to show you what the curriculum looks like when you are logged in. So Experience Biology Elementary covers 30 different lessons with the idea that you do one lesson a week to cover a school year. So it starts with Introduction to Biology, The Building Blocks of Life, The Secret Code of Life, Fueled Up, What's in a Name, Biomes Everywhere, Itsy Bitsy Teeny Tiny Creatures, The Junk Drawer Kingdom, The Fungus Among Us, What is a Plant, The Wide World of Plants, The Powerhouse of Plants, Roots and Shoots, The Pollination Equation, Seed bearing fruit, animals galore, silly sponges, wiggly worms, majestic medusas, and patient polyps. Spiny skinned savages, meddlesome mollusks, intrepid insects, spindly spiders, crabby crustaceans, the vast world of vertebrates, funky fish, amazing amphibians, resplendent reptiles, blissful birds, and marvelous mammals. Then there is also a quiz key with all the quiz answers. And then let's take a look at what a unit looks like. So first we have an introduction and we have recommended reading. These are things you can get from the library or if you choose to purchase them, that's up to you or you don't have to do it at all. 
and then there's always an activity. So in this case, it was, is it alive? And so we had some supplies we had to get and the instructions always laid out for you. And then we had some experiment sheets here that we wrote on. And then we have our quizzes. So for the sake of this review, I kept everything in one binder, but I would actually recommend each of one of your kids having different binders to store their things in. But for the sake of this review, we did have everything in the same binder. Then we also have the copy work, and then we get on to the next unit. So let's just jump back to a lesson we have not done yet. Okay, so lesson 12 is Mean Green Energy Making Machine. So again, we have our introduction, our recommended reading. Then we have our activity with supply list and the instructions. Then we have an Exploring Leaves Observation Journal. We have a place to sketch your bean plant. This is a project actually that goes over a couple weeks. So that is why it's there. I have doubles of everything for my girls. And then I have some copy work pages in print and in cursive. And then of course, the quiz, the quiz are always multiple choice like this. And we get on to the next lesson. Now let me show you the memory work. They have these cards that I actually printed out on cardstock. They come a couple to a page and you can print them out. And I just printed them on cardstock and put them on this ring here. And so then every day, we actually, this is the first one, we practice what we've learned so far. So we just, at our during our bedtime reading is when we do this, and we just go through and I ask the question, what are the five characteristics of life? And then the girls respond with the answer. And so these are really great to learn all of these scientific facts. And then we also have, these are not all of them, these are just the ones we're working on so far and then we've got um, Genesis 1 here that we are also working on memorizing. This is the whole chapter of Genesis so it's broken down into bite size chunks and so through the course of the year you will be memorizing the whole first chapter of Genesis. So that is what the memory work cards look like. And then there's the corresponding video on okay, the So website. now I'm logged in and I'm going to access my course. Now my course is Experience Biology Elementary, but if you check out the Homeschool Review Crew link down below, you can read other reviews of Experience Astronomy Elementary, Experience Astronomy Upper Level, Experience Biology Upper Level, and more reviews of Experience Biology Elementary. So definitely go check that out but let's go into Experience Biology Elementary and see what that's like. And so we have, first we have a welcome video and it talks about the program and their goals for the program. Each lesson contains a video lecture about 15 minutes long and you can basically do one lesson a week like I mentioned. There's always a recommended reading list, a hands-on activity, mem memory work, copy work, and quizzes. And the downloads are all found in here. So the first thing we have is resources and that's where you can find the quiz answer key that I just showed you plus the complete recommended reading list and the activity supply list if you want those all handy dandy rather than each lesson. Now when we go into each lesson here's what it looks like. So first thing we're going to do is we're going to click on the lesson itself and this is where we are going to find the video. So we're going to watch the video. As you can see, it's 15 minutes and 33 seconds. After we watch the video, um, there is the memory video, and this is just a couple minutes long, three minutes. That's about how, how long they all are. And this just goes over that information that is on those cards that I showed you for your memory work. And then the extra material section is where you're going to download all of those activities. So the reading list, the activities, any any papers that you need for the activities, the memory cards, the copywork pages, and the lesson quiz. So when you open that up, you're going to see that and you can print this all out like I showed you a minute ago where I had all of these printed out. So we've got the activities. And you can print out what you need and print out as many copies as you need. So this week one has the whole Genesis book the rest of the weeks do not have the Genesis book because you're going to be using that all throughout the year. Okay, 
So that is what it looks like. This curriculum has been a pure joy. I have always struggled with finding a science curriculum that I really truly enjoy and that's easy for me to actually do with my kids and this one fits the bill. My kids love it and I love it. I am fascinated by the videos. I sit and watch them with them because I learn so much too. I love how you can do as much or as little as you want. And so really what we tend to do is we watch the video and take the quiz and do the activity and the handwriting page all in one day. So we have one day where it's kind of a big science day. And then throughout the rest of the week, we are practicing our memory work and we are reading our books. So that's kind of how we structured it, but you can structure it however you want to fit the needs of your family. But I love how they are making those mental pegs with the memory work that they will use when they get to high school biology. They will remember and use this information. And so I absolutely love that. So thank you to Journey Homeschool Academy and to the Homeschool Review Crew for letting my family review this awesome curriculum. Please do check it out. I'm going to leave some links below. One is to the Homeschool Review Crew where you can read more reviews from other moms who have been using different Journey Homeschool Academy curriculums with their family. I'm also going to leave a link down below to Journey Homeschool Academy where you can learn more about Experience Biology Elementary and even get in on it for yourself. So I hope this review was helpful to you and if you have any questions, please definitely put them down below and I will definitely answer them. But we truly love this curriculum. It is by far my favorite science curriculum that I have ever used, truly.